It's about that time. Time to give a special thank you to my supporters at the Fabled Survivor Elite Tier. You can join the Fabled Survivor Elite Tier on YouTube or Patreon. Links are in the description. You guys are absolutely awesome. Thank you for helping making our dreams come true. Autumn, Sylvie, and I love you all very much. You people rock. What's up, Zombie Slayers? Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ48. Welcome back to 7 Days to Die. And now, I have not put up the last video yet, so I don't know what people had to say in the comments, but to hell with it. We're going back to the wasteland today. Yep, we're going to do it. What do you think about that, Sarah? You think that's a good idea? Yeah, Sarah Sarah loves that idea. It's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, the place is actually pretty close to my base. The next, uh, I mean, this is like, <laughs> if, if I got, if I was going to pick one building in the entire wasteland to do that was the closest to my base, this is the one. So that's actually, uh, that is actually pretty awesome. And um, I'm going to, I'm debating setting up a auto turret. Uh, on the outside, uh, we'll see about that. Uh, first things first, though. Let's. I was just kind of checking my crops; they look pretty good. Uh, first things first. Let's go ahead and see if we can make an M60. Uh, also, I did gain a level, and I put my fourth point into perception. So with the glasses, I'll be able to get demolitions expert and make efficient stacks of gunpowder next time I level, which is awesome. I went ahead and mined up a bunch of iron as well, and I'm just banging out some steel. Okay, uh, that's a pretty good amount of time right there. Let's grab this steel. Do we have 40? Uh, we do. Beautiful. You know what we're going to do? We're going to make our next M60. Hells yeah. Uh, where are we putting the gunpowder? Uh, not the gunpowder. The um, coal goes in here. Let's see what we have. So we have 1,100 nitrate and 2,200 coal. So we could definitely do one efficient stack of gunpowder, which means I'll use 800 of each and get 1,000 back. Which, I, I, you know, that's pretty dope, man. I do like that. And I got some wood logs in there. Let's take a look at the M60 and see. Wait, what? I thought I was able to. I guess not. I, I, I guess I won't be making the M60. You need a book for it, apparently. I don't know why I thought I could make the M60. I, I thought I could. Um, let's take a look at that book set. Uh, automatics. Yeah, yeah. So we need number seven on that. Okay. Fair enough. Right, are we almost done with any of these? Needle and thread. Craft military clothing. Don't care about that. We already finished the archery. Don't care about that. And it doesn't look like we're six on anything. Oh, here we go. Urban combat. Sil oh, yes. Yeah, so I was actually considering taking the silencer off my M60. My, my brain tells me the silencer on the M60 is doing sweet fuck all and is not helping me out in any way. It's hurting me because I'm doing less damage. But my, my gut tells me that eh, maybe maybe it's not calling in quite as many zombies as it would if I wasn't using it. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna keep using it just because I kind of feel like maybe it's not. I mean, it can't be zero effect, right? It's got to be doing some kind of suppression with the noise. I don't know, maybe not, but yeah, that kind of sucks, man. I can't make the M60. I was all freaking pumped. Well, that's all right. Hey, man, I can't complain. I got a blue and a freaking uh, uh, two, a blue and a two. What is that brown? Yeah, I got a blue and a brown. So. <laughs> <laughs> it's not so bad. All right, we'll put that back. And I think that brings you guys just about up to speed. Let me show you what I got going on in my bike. Because uh, one thing that I am going to need if I do use the uh, shotgun turret uh, as like a bit of a defensive, you know, thing is I'm going to need a land claim block to be able to pick it up. So we got the generator. The engine powers the generator. I've got gas on me. We hooked the generator up to the shotgun turret. We got that to hook it up. And we got that to pick it all up. I don't think I'm missing anything. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. Uh, am I going to use it today? I'm going to use it. I might not need it at the school, but whatever. I kind of want to use it. And um, because of that, we are going to have to really start like producing ammo. I'm going to need a lot of ammo if I'm going to be using these things at the POIs. So, Because last episode really kicked me in the teeth. It really did. Okay. I think I'm just going to continue organizing and do some crafting here. And um, I will see you guys in the morning. And then uh, kj 4 8s going to school. You know, there are so many things to remember when going out on a trip like this. And I'm just going to say, eh, I probably have it all. I probably have everything I need. Hopefully. I got my robot follow me. Uh, I have food, drink, ammo. You know, we'll see. We'll see. We're going we're gonna to stomp this place, man. This is going to happen. This is going to happen. We're going to be just fine. Just fine. Maybe if I just keep saying that enough, I'll believe it. Uh, yeah, this stupid fence. Damn, who put this chain link fence here, man? I don't appreciate that. 
Oh boy. Now we do not want to get stuck on anything while we're driving around here because then those birds will swoop down on us and give us instant bleeding and everything like that. Um, I'm also going to make it a little bit brighter. The only thing I didn't like about last episode was uh, it wasn't bright enough. I forgot to brighten up the video um, before I started it. So probably going to have some dogs on us now. Uh, or not. All right, so let's go ahead and brighten it up. Whenever I'm at base, I leave it at 70%. But I don't want you guys to be able to see while I'm here. All right, let's go ahead and start this. And we will put this down like so. All right, so here's the deal. I don't think I'm going to need the generator set up today, but I'm going to use it just to kind of get an idea. You know, just get an idea of how, of how things are going to go. So what we'll do is we'll put down the generator. Um, I guess I'll just put it right there. I don't know. I don't think they would attack it, but who knows. And then I'm going to put this thing facing out for the defense. For the defense! And then I'm going to refuel. Uh, not turn on. We'll put that in there. And then we will hook this up to this. And then we'll put some ammo in there. I did bring ammo. 150 should be good. Now I can I can handle what's gonna come at me in the in the POI for the most part. It's down here that's the problem, and that's why I'm gonna put this thing here. Okay. There it goes. Shoot it. I've got a bad feeling about this. I didn't lock the ammo. Okay, that's alright. I was like, why is it shooting? Oh yeah, I didn't lock the ammo. You gotta lock the ammo. Oops. Uh, lock ammo. There we go. Alright. Now let's not worry about out there. Let's just do in here. Sugar butts. Yes, yes. Very good. Oh, hello. What's up, bro? Let's make sure all our guns are loaded. They are. Well, this one's not. Kind of loaded. Okay. And the cool thing is if that gun starts shooting, it'll also be a, a bit of a... Of a warning that enemies are coming in. So. We, we should be able to... I don't know if anything's going to be able to get by that either. We'll see. I'm sure some things will be... Oh, goodness, look at this. And the cool thing is if I get overrun in here, I could just run outside. There we go. You're done. The only thing I'm worried about with that, with that weapon is uh, it calling in screamers. Done. Looks like we could grab something to drink. Alright, do you hear some dogs? Okay, so the dog didn't get killed. Damn, he barely took any damage. Okay. Fair enough. Alright, come up. Come up. Now again, I don't think I'm going to need it for this area because we're not downtown, you know? But... This is the idea. This is the idea. Maybe I should place it on the inside. You know, like place it right here. So when things walk in through the door, they get blasted. Yeah. I'm not going to move it now, but that could be something to think of for later. Why am I looting cabinets? Please stop looting cabinets. Okay. You know what? I'm done looting cabinets. I'm, I think I'm past that. Uh, I wouldn't use those anyway. They sell for 130. Let's hold on to them for now. Okay. And let's bring this up. Oh, there we go. Wow. Oh, man. If only I didn't have to clear the area. I'd still clear it, but... Alright, fine. Let's look in here. See? What a waste of time. <laughs> Should have went in my gut and ignored it. Oh, hello. Oh, man. This guy doesn't like going to school. I didn't like, I didn't like school either. I liked school in my senior year. Um, I was kind of a loser all the way up to like 12th grade. <laughs> and then I like became, it was my own fault. That was socially, you know, awkward, shy, quiet, you know. Uh, didn't care about like social trends. So when people were dressing one way, I didn't care. I just dressed whatever the hell I wanted to. And uh, it wasn't good. <laughs> but finally, when I got into um, my senior year, you know, I, um, I figured out how to like fit in everything and and it was great. But up until then, it was it was horrible. You know? So, wish I, I wish I figured out earlier. You know, I was kind of, like, um, socially stunted 
in a way. Like, like I didn't like hang out with a lot of people because like I grew up on a farm way way away from people, so I didn't have a lot of friends or anything. So it was just like it was hard to figure out how to be a, a social Master, child and alone. deal with things. You know, when you don't really have a lot of friends. So, oh boy. I'm gonna kill that dog. There you go. <laughs> Fudge you, dog. Fudge you. Am I supposed to be breaking into these? Sure, why not? Oh, not bad. I don't need it, but that clip extender is pretty dope. I can also tell by how how crazy the shotgun's going. If, like, what's coming at me is going to be really, really something I need to worry about. Or just a couple of zombies or a dog or something. Just grab that. Check that. Hello. Are you guys coming in from outside? Okay. I'd prefer if you didn't. I'd prefer if you go in through the door. Because that's where I have my, my you know, turret of death. All right. oh, what the hell am I doing? Alright, uh, yes, I can eat that. Uh, I can eat this. I can scrap this. Alright. Oh, here we go. Here we go! Ugh, one piece of paper? Come on, now! I'm probably gonna skip a lot of loot to try and get by these a little bit quicker. Okay, so come up here. I've got a bad feeling about this. Come on out of there. Oh, you're not up there? Oh, there he is. Hey, what's your problem, bro? Don't break that. Ah, oh, you get out of my business. You're all up in my face. Don't appreciate that. I gotta get some better knucks, man. When, when am I gonna get steel knuckle parts? I mean, I've got a few, but... Man, they are really far and few in between. I felt like this place is a death trap before. But now there doesn't seem to be anybody here. Oh, that's a good thing to get. That's actually a really good thing to get. <gasps> Wait, I thought you get it from a book! Wait a minute. Oh, so I guess it could be either. M60. No, it says automatic weapons handbook. It doesn't say anything about a schematic. I thought it would say you could get it from a schematic as well. Um, hold on. Automatic, automatic. Automatic. Yeah, so I guess there's two different ways you can get it. Well, there you go. <laughs> Boy, man, that's some. Uh, that's a lucky Great freaking find. Get the hell out of the way, you stupid drone. That is an unbelievably lucky find. <laughs> okay, well, when it rains, it pours. Yeah, that's, um... Honestly, I'm not really surprised at that, to be perfectly frank with you. If I could be frank for a second. I'm not frank. My name's Jim. Nice to meet you. Yeah, that was, um... I, see, I thought it would say a schematic. I guess not. I... So... Yeah. Master, we are not good. alone. Oh, boy. Get the freak out of here. Get your freaking face out of here. Any ferals? Uh, yep, one right there. Oh, dude, I punched right through him and hit her. One feral is not that bad. It's when you get more than one. It starts to become an issue. Boom goes the head. Uh, guess I won't just drink just yet. Those drinks give you, like, 60 thirst. Is my thirst 100 or does my thirst go up just like my hunger? That's a good question. I should probably check that. You know what? I'll just check it right now. Also, loot stage 179. Oh yeah, water's 151, so I can drink one of those waters and not lose anything. Because it only gives 60. Alright, cool. See, I, I knew my hunger would go up uh, as, you know, as everything else went up. Like, as my, like, I guess my levels go up, everything else goes up. But I just didn't, it didn't click that the drink would do that too. Yeah, boy. I'm like a ninja. 
How much is that going to sell for? Well, One fifty-six. Not, not as much as I would have thought for a purple item, but it is a a light purple item. Oops. What? What are you doing? There you go. Okay. Definitely going to wrench some stuff. I'm going to have to start collecting brass because I am out of brass at home. Well, not out of brass. I've got like I've probably got enough brass for about a thousand rounds, but I don't have any more brass after that. And that makes me nervous. Alright, you ready? My senses have picked up something. Mm -hmm. Alright, just you. Just you. Alright, now also, uh, just so you guys know, when I pick up my... At least, uh, from what I understand, when I pick up my land claim block, it shouldn't allow zombies to spawn in my house because I have a bedroll down. So, just, just so you know. Now, if I pick up both of them, zombies can spawn at my base. And it's not honestly, that's not even really a big deal. I can just go back and kill them. You know, like, who cares? Not that big of a deal. This is my home. My house. I hear something. Yeah. There you go. Boom goes the head. Give me all those chairs. Getting a little bit of lag here. Maybe just because I was running around like an idiot. Uh, yeah, I think it's time for some inventory management. Okie dokie. Let's keep on keeping on. I think I'm probably going to make a trip down to my bike before the end loot, though. Oh, you're a feral. <laughs> Close the door right on Edgar. You don't like that. Edgar's not a fan. Of my shenanigans. Tough shit, Edgar. Oh, gun's going crazy down there. That gun's doing work, man. I think that's a good idea. I, I think I might have stumbled onto something that's going to work for me. Which is good. But, you know, we won't know for sure. I don't know why I'm eating this. We won't, I should probably start keeping that because I do want to make bandages. Ah, too late now. I don't care. It's on the ground. Engine! Oh, I thought you were guaranteed an engine. Can you get an engine from one of these? Let's see. Nope. I didn't think so, but it was worth a try. Uh, what do we got in here? It's not going to be an engine in a toolbox. Okay, and what's behind door number 100? Why did I do that? There we go. I'm always hitting A. What's with, what's with hitting A, Cage? Oh, that's nice. That's nice, too. Two nice things right there. Uh, D10% more damage to safes. Wow, that's actually a good heist book. I didn't think there was any heist books I would care about. I was wrong. I was wrong. I was really wrong. Don't these teachers have any computers for me to wrench? I guess not. Okay. Uh, no, where the hell am I supposed to go? Yeah, that's where I came from. All right, so it doesn't look like it's gonna be more... Oh, am I supposed to go downstairs? I guess so. Yeah, this kind of rings a bell. Wish I had some grenades. This is prime grenade real estate. I've got a bad feeling about this. Oh, boy. All right. Oh, stop it. Just stop it. Okay, and you're done! I guess he's not done. Oh, you're done now. Just in time. The boss likes to call it just in time inventory. That's when he runs out of something, and then he gets it like right at the last minute. But it, a lot of times it's not just in time, but he calls it just in time anyway. But that's what that's what you could do when you're the boss. You guys run your own bagel store, you could tell your people that it's just in time. I'll take that. Oops. Can I make steroids? Good question. Uh, steroids. Uh, no, I cannot. Oh, it's physician? Wait, how far in physician? I think it's pretty far in physician. Yeah, I'll probably go to surgeon, honestly. We'll see. We will see. 
Oh, here we go. A TV, finally. Yeah. Not a lot of TVs in this school. Now, can I eat that? I cannot. But I could scrap that. All right. Uh, do I care about any? Nah, I don't care about anything in there. Oh, okay. We're getting near the end. Very cool. I will definitely go drop stuff off, though, before the end. So you can't spawn stuff in there. So you actually go in the room. Oh, cool. Thank you, zombies. Thank you, zombies. That's great. So now I can go out there to drop my stuff off. Master, we are not alone. We're not? What do you mean we're not alone? What are you talking about? Where are they coming from? Are they behind me? Are they outside? Well, this guy is. Oh, my shotgun turret's not going to help me now. That's okay. Alright. So I don't know where those guys were. It sounded like they were kind of in the ceiling or something, but I don't know. Alright. Sounds like they're outside. I don't know. I'm not going to worry about it. Alright. So that's the last room. Well, let's go ahead and drop stuff off, then we'll take it out. Alright. Went ahead and dropped everything off. I'm not even going to mess around with the shotgun on this one. Is this, this place... Oh! They've already spawned. Right, we gotta take care of that guy, right? Yeah, let's do it. We're gonna get the sneak attack, which is nice. He's down. And he's out. You dead? No, he's not dead. Now he's dead. Oh shit, he's not dead. Okay, now he's dead. Alright, beautiful. Alright, cool, that worked. They spawned a little bit early. They spawned, but they didn't know I was here. That's a bad spot for them to be in. Hell yeah, it is. Okay. So, uh, we do have some candy. There we go. And that'll bring us up to, what, 190? Oh, 203! We're above 200! Doesn't that mean we get better stuff if we're above, like, two, uh, 200? Isn't that like a, like a breaking point or something? I don't know. Maybe. Alright. Uh, what do you got? Okay. Something I don't have, at least. Alright, not bad. I like that. Uh, is that all the stuff here besides the main one? Looks like it. How many uh, things do I have? 33? Should be okay with that. Should be okay with that. Well, guys, this run has made me feel... I mean, I'm not out of here yet, but this run has made me feel a lot better... Because I was really, like, you guys could tell by last episode, when my when my commentary, like, just quiets up and I, I don't really have anything to say, you know I'm, like, out of my comfort zone. And that was last episode. I was not happy about having to fail on that POI. But this one, um, you know, oh, yeah, cool. Got a treasure map. Is that my second treasure map? I think it is. Let me take a look. Uh, treasure... Okay, I think that's the same name, isn't it? Nope. Cool. Alright, so where are these? I know one, I know the one's up here. Oh, okay. And I think the other one's up here somewhere. No, that's the that's the first one. Where's the other one? Traitor, traitor. Oh, okay. Maybe we'll do a treasure episode. I don't know. You think two is enough to do a treasure treasure map episode? Possibly. Let's go turn in this quest. Well, I don't know how much that shotgun turret was really needed, but, you know, it, it definitely helped. It definitely helped. I think next time I'll put it inside the building, like, facing the door. So when they walk in the door, they kind of get blasted. It might be a better way to do it. Um, one thing I did over... Can you guys... All right, here, guys. Let me... Let me. You answer right now. And then, I'm going to ask a question. You're going to give me an answer right now. You're going to answer before I give you the answer. I'm going to let you know what the thing was. But I want you to tell me in the comments, what did I forget about that shotgun turret generator setup that I did at the, um, that I just did at that POI. What did I forget? I screwed something up. What did I screw up? Let me know in the comments. I'm going to give you three seconds. Pause the video. Three, two, one. Now you better say it before I tell you, because if you, if, if I tell you and then you go ahead and say afterwards, trying to play it off like you knew before I told you, don't, don't play that game, guys. I'll know. I always know. All right. 
I don't have anything to repair the shotgun turret. It took damage and I can't pick it up. So what I did was I marked the shotgun turret. Okay. And I'll go back there with stuff to repair. I mean, look at how close it is. I'll go back there with stuff to repair at some point and uh, grab that shotgun turret. Uh, so I got to bring stuff to repair, which I think is iron, electrical, mechanical parts. So. Master, uh, we are not alone. Right yeah, yeah, yeah. No, we're alone. Shut up. We're alone, damn it. I did break into that. Yes, I did. Incredible. Okay. What are we getting here? Wow, that's actually um pretty mediocre stuff. I mean, it's not like it's bad stuff. It's just not anything I need in any way, shape, or form. I mean, maybe the shovel's an upgrade? Nope. Uh, first aid kits would be nice. I could well, I'd sell this. I would sell the steel shovel. Uh, high power. Yeah. All right. Uh, I'm gonna take the first aid kits and the shovel. Okay. What other jobs you got? No, I'm not doing tier fives. Screw that. Maybe, maybe at some point, not today, and not anytime soon. Well, maybe kind of soon, but not super soon. Actually, where are they all? Look at this. I got a far most of them are away. Ugh. All right, previous tier. Uh, fetch clear. Downtown strip. I don't like that downtown strip stuff. Uh, no. Nope. That was tier five. Uh, jobs, previous tier. There's this I'm not doing a clothing store. <laughs> no thanks. Not a doer. Uh, clear zombies. A job for you. Grocery if store? You're like, What's my Maybe. Name? It's not, not exactly sexy. <laughs> no, you're a chicken. I got a job for you. Waterworks. Well, Where is that? Get busy. Is that in the get wasteland? Uh, yeah, that's definitely in the wasteland. That's going to be a tough one, guys. That's going to be a tough one. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to like look around the area when I actually go out to do it and I'm going to set up a little bit of a forward operating base and put down a um a sleeping bag because if I die out here, I don't want to be riding a bicycle through all this. So, yeah. But I actually I think next the video is probably going to be a building video, but I'm talking about the next video I actually go out and, you know, do stuff. Did I level? I did not. I almost leveled. We're almost we're almost to level. And then I'll be able to make the gunpowder. I'll probably get that during the night while I'm mining. All right, guys, I am going to call this one here. If you end up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy. You may wonder why I'm laughing. It's this freaking, like, horde of undead following me around. <laughs> oh, I love it.